What's up guys, here is Claudio from Visual Moodle WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to get started using the Smart Slider 3 WordPress plugin. Every website should have or may have a slider into the front page or into some page, it's a very famous way of design, but some slider plugins like Revolution Slider is a quite expensive. So Smart Slider is a free plugin. We already learned how to install this plugin and apply this slider shortcode into pages or posts. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here for these guides. Now we're gonna learn how to use this plugin, how to get started with the plugin edits. This is a very basic guide with the first step so you can locate yourself and start doing your own changes with your imagination. First of all, go to WordPress dashboard, Smart Slider 3, select the slider. For this guide, we're going to be using the tutorial slider. That is a example demo slider that came with when you install the plugin automatically. And these sliders have some basic elements that can help you to understand the plugin usage and work. The look and feel. If you hover your mouse over the editor, First of all, make sure that you select the slider. I'm editing the very first one. So just hover your mouse over the slider, click on edit, and you're gonna be opening this editor screen. Here, you can click in any single element of the slides and edit. This slide is already have a um, raw inside it and some columns. And in each column, the elements that can be called as layers, just like Photoshop does. After some edit, you can edit hovering your mouse over the element and select the three dot icons to delete an element, copy an element, or open the editor view. Make sure that you save your changes so you can view the result into the front end, just like I'm doing. Now, if you go to the slides, you can create a new slide for example, here, I'm going to be creating a image, a image, an image slider. Select an image. If you select two images, you're going to be creating two sliders. Now, hover your mouse over the new sliders and click on Edit Green button. Now, you're going to be able to edit the sliders in the way that you want. I will not add a um, raw into the slider yet. I'm going to be probably making this in a future video, so you can understand the layouts. But now, keep on your mind that you can select the elements, position the elements using the presets. For example, if you go to the content, after clicking on this heading text, You can duplicate, preset, and if you go to the content, you can align it, like vertical alignment and inline alignment. You can do the same with your text element, your button, and align everything onto your slider. Let's save these changes just to take it as an example. Now go back to the slider title, in my case it's tutorial slider, copy the short code and apply it into a page, just like we did in our previous video using this plugin. So we can display this slideshow into our website. Just post the slider short code into your page and let's preview it. And it is. Our slider is on the page and we have edited some parts of it. Deleting elements, applying elements, applying a link into this button. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmodel.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes and full compatibility to Smart Slider 3 WordPress plugin. And I see you later. All the best.